Finally! I'm away from Seamus and his constant nagging about economics. I can say whatever I want and no one will correct me! Not even you! Economic value is determined by the state! Central planning is fantastic! Money is an evil invention made to enslave us! <laughs> Going ice fishing in Antarctica without telling a single soul where I am is the smartest thing I've ever done. Whoa! Wow. It looks like this primitive specimen was from a time before our advanced computer graphics took over. Yes. He was drawn on something known as... Paper. Well, that's quitting time. Charlie, let's get the heck out of here. You got it. <laughs> oh my gosh, the caveman has thawed. <laughs> and it's alive. Where am I? Who are you? My name? is Charlie, and this is a museum. What's a museum? Ah! I don't think I'm qualified to deal with soggy cavemen. We need to get you and your penguin friend to a hospital. We are acquaintances. Ah, stupid Barbie cheat. This is the only thing you could find to push me around in? I don't get why you're so upset about this, Bob. Royalty used to ride around in these. Whoa. This is what the future looks like? Yeah, it's pretty awesome. It took a few centuries after your time. We found tons of new and more efficient technologies to improve our lives all around. No, oh, no. You're starting to sound just like the guy I was trying to get away from. So no matter what you said, this guy would give you an economics lecture? It never ended with him. Kind of seems like he was just trying to help. What's wrong with that? It was so annoying. What was your friend's name? Seamus! No! Oh. What will happen to Bob? What's in store for the future of humanity? Subscribe to this channel, hit the bell icon, and find out on the next exciting episode of Common Sense Soapbox. Bob to the future! <laughs> <laughs>